Question 22 in the ASA blue paper. So to answer question 22, you need to know one sort of fact about light, and that is this, that a ray of light parallel to the principal axis that enters a converging lens on one side of the principal axis will converge to the other side of the principal, principal axis upon exiting the lens. So what does that mean? Basically, if we have light on one side of this principal axis, in this case, the upper side of the principal axis, and it enters this converging lens, what's going to happen is the converging lens is going to bend this light and it's going to converge towards the other side of that principal axis. So what does this mean for each of the respective lights? So from the perspective of a person behind the lights, so as in the lights are in between that person and the lens, you'll see this following configuration of the light. So the green is in the top left hand corner, the red is in the top right hand corner, the yellow bottom left and blue bottom right. So since the light crosses the principal axis, um, we can draw essentially the principal axis on our little diagram. And what's going to happen is the blue light, once it passes through the converging lens and hits the screen, well, it's going to be on the top side of that screen. But we've got to remember, however, that the principal axis not only exists in the vertical plane, but also in the horizontal plane. So there's a principal axis both horizontally and vertically. So therefore, when the blue light, which is originally in the bottom right hand corner, goes through the converging lens, it crosses not only upwards, but also to the left. So the blue light will now be in the top <clears throat> left hand corner. So therefore, we can predict that the blue light will be in position four um, on the screen, and that corresponds to an answer of D. Um, you can check, check the answers for all the other lights, but um, you'd find that they all follow this pattern where they cross um, not only in the horizontal plane, but also in the vertical plane. So therefore, the answer for question 22 is D.